What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Hunter X here, bringing us another episode of Project Ozone 3 Cabin Mode No EMC Super Fight. With that being said, if you're new around here, smash that subscribe button, smash that like button, and let's get into today's episode. Why is it every time I go to go start an episode, it's nighttime? Literally, every time. All right, I need a little bit of iron. Um, you know, we already have iron on us. I do need one piece of nether quartz though, because I am going to work on something right now. And that is the fact that I'm trying to get a, uh, I'm trying to get the lava upgrade for the furnace. Uh, that way I don't have to keep using coal. It's basically infinite, right? Because we've got infinite lava now. At this point, we've got infinite lava generation, so yeah, it's probably best if we switch over to lava as a uh, as a fuel source, uh, right? Because we've got infinite of it, and we don't have to worry about it like ever since it's infinite, which makes me super duper happy, right? I also found out a new technique. Apparently, you can use the X Niho. Or X now ho uh thingies uh hammer on your why am I going outside for this? All oh, right, because I need to I need to hook it up to fuel. I don't need you anymore. So what I need to do is take my uh my iron pipes and bring them up like that. Now my hammer's inside. I suppose I can't use this one, right? Oh I can. Oh, yes. That should be nice and full. Now, anytime I need to do smelting, that should work beautifully now. Without. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I, that's what I need in my life. A little bit of automation, you know? All right, so we got this stuff. Uh, the next few things that I'm going to want to work on today are getting ourselves situated with some item ducks uh not bad item ducks aren't that expensive to make we're gonna need quite a bit of them actually all right so i i didn't dig the tunnels underground for this area just yet which i know i should have um so now i just need to quickly grab not this one, but my other one. Where is my other one? I don't think I have it with me, do I? I don't have it with me. All right, which way am I facing? This way? Oh, there's going to be some water here. I still got to fill this in as well. Yeah, we've got a lot of stuff on us to take care of today. Uh, today, I, I want to get this at least going and producing some stuff so with that being said um let me do some cleaning up and i will be right back all righty guys so i've been working really hard to kind of get this up and going i love how it emits light wait Oh, this isn't right. I gotta push this wall back one, I think. Yeah. I gotta push this wall back. Crap. We have to push this wall back. I was like, this doesn't feel right. That's right. That's fine. We can push the wall back. We just gotta make sure that torches line up with torches here. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, right? No, 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 no. Okay, yeah. I think it's time that we fill this freaking lake in, guys. Literally. Yeah, I think it's time about time that we fill this damn lake in. Alrighty, guys. So, this is how this is gonna work. So, what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna dig a hole here. And here. Okay. Right? 
So I'm going to show you guys how this is going to work. This is actually pretty smart. So I'm going to go ahead and grab myself some wood. Okay. I'm going to grab wood. And I should have a few empty chests laying around. Perfect. We're going to need a couple of these, so we might as well just make them while we can. Right. And then I'm going to grab my ducks that we have. Nope, that's not where I wanted you to go, buddy. So these guys are going to be what's going to be filling our containers, right? Our thingy my bobbers. You place the wrong way. I want you facing me, not the other side. So what I might need to do here then is place down a pipe. Yeah. So something like that. And that's how that's going to work. I'm also going to build a ladder system. We might end up moving that up on the wall. We'll see. So now what's going to happen is... In each one of these is going to create a nice little ducting system just like this oh nope. right okay we don't need these these are extra right perfect and we're going to do that for each side, right? So you're going to come all the way down. Now, keep in mind, this is going to be very slow. Uh, these are the very slow item docks, but it's better than nothing, right? So you can't complain, right? Better than making transfer pipes and or transfer nodes okay and then what i'm gonna do is i'm probably oh that's not where i wanted to dig we'll, we'll have liquid pipes coming from the center coming all the way down uh fluid pipe we could even have well i was gonna say iron pipes but iron pipes get pretty expensive oh fluid ducts i didn't think about that fluid ducts which just requires some copper and some glass which we can easily do right and that's going to be the input system i'm okay i'm thinking hold on Yeah. Something like this. I wonder how that would look. Hold on. Let's, do I have an axe on me? I do. Wow, would you look at that? Magical. I want to see something. And then put your, your drawers down. That actually might work. That might be even better. I guess what I would have to do then, if I was going to say, so to speak, do that, is do that. I need to get my crescent hammer. And then when I'm over there, I might as well make some drawers and do all the shebang while I'm over here. Right? Do the full shebang. Get everything kind of ready, if you will. And do that, that. Now that's not gonna make me enough, but ten drawers should be, ten drawers should be good enough for now. Oh, what do we have for copper? We probably don't have a lot of copper yet. I didn't think so. Yeah, let's go ahead and grab. 
Let's grab some of that. Shift K. Maybe not. Fine. Probably because my inventory is too full. All right, that'll get us two stacks of copper. Uh, let's see what I can get with for right now. Glass in the center. And that's going to be... 48, that might be enough to do what I want to do. Not. Oh, that's right. When I put the drawer down, that's right. I was like, why are you like that? So what we'll do is, oh, I forgot my crescent hammer over there as well. That's all right. We, we'll probably have to go back over. We do got to go back there over. Oh, go back over there anyways, because we do need uh to grab uh, more copper just in case if we need it all right good i mean it's not gonna cook that fast but you know all right can i do this with this nope damn it man i guess i can do it with a shovel i have a shovel in my hand hot bar how convenient um right i came over here because i wanted you whoops to down here and what we need to do is disable any connections uh that these may make so for example, here and here at the bottom. So you, you, and that will, yeah, that'll take care of that. I just got to make sure that these don't connect in any shape, way, or form because we need these to not connect right yes i keep thinking that i'm gonna keep placing down a fluid duct and that's not the case i'm placing down item ducts because i think with the shaders it makes it look like a, a fluid duct when it's in your hand i think we're out of item ducts and i got them all right I did. Yay. Nappy time. Nappy time. Nappy time. All right. So that should be pretty much all set up and ready to go. And in, well, I was going to say in between episodes, I did set up Electrum to be crafted. Which is nice. Um, We need iron. We need a lot of stuff. We need lots of stuff to make this work. All right, I need you to be, I need you to give me a decent amount of nuggets. I need you to give me a stack of redstone and I need four, eight, I need 16 total servos. I think. Something like that. And I, yeah, that's not including. That's not including the servos I need for the thing. And I, and I think for right now, an iron drum should do just fine. Two iron drums should do just fine for right now. Uh, we, we won't be filling it up that quick. Uh, and that should be just fine. And what we're going to do is we're going to set this up in a way like this. Put a hole, put a hole. Set up two fluid ducts. And then set up our tanks. And then yeah 
it just got super complicated very quickly uh you yeah this is like super early game automation i can't wait till we get into conduits man conduits are gonna be a lifesaver like i love ender io conduits the fact that everything is in one block space yeah i don't think i'm gonna have enough here realistically i could have that be pulled into one technically but yeah we'll eventually upgrade this to be like two like massive drums that will allow us to uh yeah i'm shy a few ducks that's all right we can go ahead and make more and that means i'm gonna need at least eight more servos at least minimum uh glass copper all right yeah that should be more than enough and then i wouldn't mind making a few more of these i think that's what i need not really sure but we will find out uh once we uh get this all automated this is gonna be really nice by the way all right good so i don't have flight so this is gonna be even tricky even trickier than you think because it's hard to see where you're clicking. All right, good. Hey, behave yourself. Good. I'm pretty sure each one of the, each one of these rows has four of these. Yeah. Wait, why did I count? Why did I count 24? 8 plus 2 plus 8 is 18. Not 24. Yeah, because you're going to want 2 here. Or 1 here. For this random round robin. Round robin. On both of these. And then this is just going to be a extract. Always active. And insert into your, nope, oh, wrong one. Can I get that back, please? Thank you. Set these up. Hey. Wait, I want to make sure I have that set up on the right thing. Hold on. Yep, don't want to clog the system. And I think as far as I'm concerned, that should now be fully automated. In theory. I hope. Uh, so now we just need to quickly toss those in there for now. That in there for now. That in there for now. All my ingots and stuff can go in there. Uh, block, 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 block. I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I want to do right now. And, I, and there's a couple things I want to work on. So. A, I need a drawer key. And that should be relatively simple ish to make. 
uh, that's gonna allow me to make upgrades. And then the upgrades, which are what I need. I need a gold nugget plus a gold nugget plus two gold ingots. I thought I may have had gold nuggets hanging around, but I guess not. That's fine. Not too much of a big deal at all. There we go. All right. Well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and run around here and lock these drawers because we don't want them to, you know, get filled with junk or anything like that. All right, good. They should all be locked now. Now I'm going to... Do I have at least 18 stacks? I don't even think I have 18 stacks of coal. That should be... All right, there's nine stacks right there. I definitely don't have 18 stacks. Wait, yeah. All right, nine stacks of coal in here. That should now get evenly distributed across these machines. In theory. Oh, don't even. Okay, I was about to say it's slow. Okay. I was about to say. Like, I was about to flip out. I was like, this better work. <laughs> because I set all this up. It better freaking work. Because I don't want to have to sit up the other way. All right. How much coal do you think I have? All right. That's two stacks right there. All right. That's kind of like enough. Yeah, I'm going to do a little bit of mining. I'm going to do some mining and I shall be back. Alrighty, guys. So, I've been uh, AFK for a minute or two. And uh, I got to say, this is this automation is working quite well, if I say so myself. So, all we need to do is shove these in here. And we're good. This is now fully automated Coke and a fully automated creosote, which is just absolutely wonderful. So one of the things I do want to do is we got to move our farm over here, right? This is we're, we're going to knock this down. Uh, we're going to take this down because, you know, this is going to be something else now. This is going to be our little immersive engineering area. Uh. Let's see, do I not have any dirt with me? I don't, that's fine. We can go ahead and take this out now because we don't need it. Bada bing, bada boom. I mean, yeah, we might wanna kinda, yeah. I might wanna kinda refill this wall in one. Uh, that might be uh, the plan of action. And then we can also uh, grab, let me grab my, this. I gotta repair it first. Do a little bit of repairy boy, repairy boy stuff. And then. And then I'm gonna do something here. Uh, I might as well try. Wait, where did my thing go? What? Where did my what? Where the hell did my excavator go? Eh? Oh, it's right there. I was like, where did my excavator go?
I want to add a little bit of detail. Just a little detail. And then, yeah, we're, I'm probably going to relocate this. Yeah, I think, yeah, we're going to, we're going to remove that wall back one. And I'm going to try to like, maybe like trim this out a little better. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's a pretty big pathway. And then we can go ahead and do that. Well, this is probably going to be like extended out like one more. So to speak. So like all oh, this is going to be moved and everything. But. I shall figure that out next time. And what I want to do. Uh, what do we want to do to uh, make this look. A little nicer. So to speak. Right. But yeah, that's fully automated creosote oil uh, done. Now, I would ideally, I'm not sure if thermal has covers. I mean, it looks like we do have covers. Uh, combined with a block to create covers. Uh, details provides structure. Um... I'm gonna have to test to see how that works in between episodes. Now I do want to, you know, make things a little bit nicer and everything by getting like, you know, like nice lanterns if possible. If we can get like lanterns that don't require power or maybe even require power, right? That would be really cool to have just like things just like hanging around, but I'm not sure. Oh, uh, lantern. Uh, we have these guys from Bibliocraft. They are craftable. Uh, sea lanterns, lan jack o' lanterns, fancy lights, ember lanterns. We have these guys. Wait, do these power lanterns? Yeah, we could make these. I wonder if these, and then you can do the the poles. I think they're called not electric poles. I forget what they're called. They're from immersive. Immersive. They're the these things, the wooden posts, which need the treated wood. Which we we do have treated wood now, which is nice, right? I like that. So that's good. So we'll maybe start like putting like posts and stuff out on the outside of it, on the outside of the building and stuff. Oh. Oh, I just thought about something. I wonder. I mean, I can use fences to like hang down from the ceiling and yo, I have a lot of ideas, guys. Unfortunately, though, it is time to wrap up today's episode. With that being said, if you guys did enjoy today's episode, please do me a huge favor. Smash the like button, smash the subscribe button, ding dong that notification bell, become a part of the Hunter's Tribe by hitting that subscribe button. Also by joining our Discord and also following me on all my social medias across the board. Everything is in the description, as always, like in every single video. But as always, guys, I'm going to love you. I'm going to leave you. Till next time.